Hey guys, I'm Danny Light from Basecraft Audio. In this video, I want to show you how you can layer, not layer, make layer, yeah, like wild styles leads. Uh, I will not talk too long. First of all, the pre wife and then I will show what layers I did use. This was pre-wave. Yeah, not one to one, but pretty much similar. Let's start with main lead. Uh, for first layer, I did use this uh, must go to from Basecraft Audio uh, sound sets, but I use from sound set sound sets from Basecraft Silent 1 and Zero Months This one is first layer Paint distorted soft lead and feels like noisy I cut out this low end and just died with this little bit of the high very little and nothing special going on on this first layer second layer is back in time pretty much distorted lead for EQ say basic uh, EQ is cutting out this low end And third, it are like reset and just kind square square feeling lead and same. Oops, this slightly out. Then I cut out more the high end. Basically, high end we get from the chords. For the main processing, for the bus group, how it's on, how it called in your life. Don't go fancy. Just add with this punch. Pretty nice plugin for leads. I like to use them for leads. Of course, on TT. This is main lead layer. Now for the chords. So I also don't do nothing fancy. Serum and some set from Basecraft Audio. I bounce it is uh, MIDI to audio. As I get spikes. This one is 
top chord more high end. See, I get pretty much sparks. And second is any octave to give that life for the lead. The rules I don't go nothing too fancy. Pretty pretty basic. Um OTT. EQ here I add dynamic little bit punch coat is meat because we get a lot of meat from lead melody itself. Punch really giving that punch for the leads <laughs> that I really love. And yeah, basically that's it. I will upload uh, MIDI files to the Basecraft community, by the way, yeah. We just launched the Basecraft community, you can join. And see you in the next video. You can also request videos on the forum. See you.